It's now been three years since I went on this journey, and all that because of one man. I owe this man so much more than anyone can imagine. Not just for showing me everything I know about this craft, more for making me the man that I am today. Before I met him, I wasn't sure what I want to do in my life. I was working here and there, trying to find something that makes me happy. On the weekends, I was working as a DJ in a bar downtown, barely making enough money to survive. I knew something had to change. Then one night, at a nightclub, I met Eric. He gave me the chance to follow him to some shoots, sit down and watch him edit. And just from seeing what he creates, I knew that that is what I want to do for the rest of my life. After a couple projects, we decided to work together, but we had to come up with a name. I wrote our names on a piece of paper and then realized that our initials when set in the right order say crew. Now we only had to add the number. The 13 stands for both of our birthdays being May 13. After a year, Eric had to leave to Rapid City due to him still being in the military. With him, all the gear that I've used was gone. To that time, I couldn't afford a camera or any video gear that I would need to make a living and follow my dream. One of my best friends, Robin, was working for a well-known landscape photographer and he introduced us. Me and Girl quickly realized that we get along very good. I joined his team and him and the guys like Max, Peter and Robin helped me to buy the gear that I would need to continue make videos. With all the gear in my hand, I was super excited to start traveling with the boys. We went to places I never thought I would see in my life. Going there, being creative as a team while doing what I love was amazing. I learned so much in the first trips already and I was inspired by the drive girl has to follow his dream. I know that this doesn't happen to everybody and I will work as hard as I can to make this one man proud. This one man that changed my entire life gave me a direction to go and a common dream to follow. When I was a little kid, I wanted to become a train driver. I loved the idea of controlling powerful machines. Now, 20 years later, I work with the most powerful machine on this planet my camera. All I can say is I am doing what I love now and I'm trying to show it in every single clip that I'm presenting you. Dealing with all these emotions and moments that can catch a person's feelings and turn them upside down in seconds is the most powerful thing for me. Looking back on the last three years is crazy. I know it can be hard to see your glasses half full in times of darkness, but no matter what situation life puts you in, at the end of the day, the choice is yours. I chose to chase this dream and not become a golf teacher like my mom and dad wanted me to be. If there is one thing that I've learned in the past, is that you shouldn't ask yourself what the world needs, but ask yourself what makes you come alive. <laughs>